<sighs> Alright. Let's do this. This is really cool though. I'm actually genuinely impressed just like how well they've managed to kind of incorporate everything. Doing something like this alone requires a lot of work. And like the make sure that's actually functional. Like the fact that the rendering distance is I would argue not as bad as it could be. Like obviously it's not perfect, but I would argue that it's pretty good. Consider it's considering the amount of detail in the environment, it is very very good. I think is probably the best way to think about it. Cuz it's very easy to be like, "Oh yeah, well, you know, render in distance." But then you're like, there's literally nothing in the thing anyway. It's like Pokémon Scarlet and Violet. <laughs> Get wrecked, Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. But you know what I mean, right? Like, obviously it's a small system, so... There's that to take into consideration. But it is about that kind of, like, looking at the two and being like... You know, Wait. like... The render distance is not that great. What am I missing? Is not that great in Pokemon Scarlet, but on the other hand, um, what am I missing? It's not that great in Pokemon. Oh no, wait, it said Hogsmeade, didn't it? No, 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 no. It's not that great in Pokemon Scarlet, but it's also. There's also not a whole lot of things in the environment. While this is like, whoa, there's tons of trees and detail and things you have to kind of like suss out and figure out. It works really well, actually. Too quickly earlier. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? True. Oh, no flying zone. All right, all right. I see you. And that's the boundary line. Okay. Wait. So did I finish that quest then? Legendary. Alright, now I just have this one to do, but I can't do it yet. One, because I have to find a troll. And two, because I need to learn to pulse. So. Let's do this one first. I was planning on ending stream around like 4.30, maybe a little later, but now my brain's like, maybe I need a nap for GVDs. <sighs> Blue flames. It's interesting to think that you could literally just, theoretically, go sleep. 
All right. <laughs> I can't watch anymore anyway. You're like caught up to me. Ah, okay. That's all right, man. Where am I going? Okay, this way. But, um, yeah. No, it's alright. I'm probably just gonna keep chug a lugging through the game. Who will complete the game? Me or Diddy first? I will have to go a bit slower later in the week because I've got work, so. Where am I going? What's through this wall? I'm very slow. Ah, okay. Okay, back down. I have like double your hours in the same progress. <laughs> no, it's okay, man. You're taking your time. You're enjoying it. I'm enjoying this in a slightly different fashion. I definitely wish I could take my time as much as you are. Um, but because I'm kind of looking forward to... Oh, here we go. Because I'm kind of looking forward to just playing the game with my own kind of time. I'm kind of How did you get on with those tasks? Waiting for that. Madam Kozawa, so. I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Yay. Yeah. Yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Well, with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. Why would you be teaching me a spell called Glacius? It's literally a mountain. Well done. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here in my office before taking it out into the world. Okay. Miss Madame Kogawa. Marvelous news that you would be joining the faculty at Hogwarts as our new flying instructor. Instructor, I dare say our work together at Hogwarts will be less eventful than our time near Yokohama Harbor. Though one never knows. I shall look forward to seeing you soon. If you have any questions in the meantime, please do not hesitate to send me an email. Cool. Alright, bye. I have things to do. Just finished my homework now. I need food, then Hogwarts. <laughs> do it. What's this? Beast classes. Okay. <gasps> oh, I can learn the Alohomora. Ooh. Anyway. Slowly but surely. Um, yeah, and I'll be streaming more of this later anyway, so. Uh, 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 at least I intend to. Still part of me that's like, oh, sure you want to play more? The other part of me is like, hell yeah. I'm going to stream something different tomorrow night anyway. I don't know. I'm thinking about doing just like a rando or something. Just because it's Valentine's Day, I'm like, this, like, I could do something cool, but on the other hand, I'm like, 
you know what? Do like a seed that's cold, be my valentine, and see how cruel it is, you know? Does the seed say yes or no? We'll find out. When Professor Sharp is so intimidating. He's so cool. Those two, I swear. They're so cute. I love that they look as excitable as first years. You know, you'd think that by now they'd be like, oh, fuck this shit. How are your assignments coming along? Yeah, they're going all right. I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn to pulso. Let's see what you can do. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. Flick that wand. And I think you should. Perhaps best not to go flinging your classmates about the halls. I suggest having a chance at books here. I like how the others are like, here, practice this on this training dummy. Meanwhile, he's just like, ah, oh, just do it on the books. I'm glad to see that you seem to Spell casting. Cool. Nice. Ooh. All right. Through the next set of doors over here. You idiot! Lonnie has served our family for five generations, and you go and give her clothes. Now Oops. I will have to cook and clean until we can replace her with another elf. Did oh. you think of that? Or do you hate your mother that much? Wow, asshole. Bet they just walk away. Okay. Life seems rather dull in the hamlets around here. I'd much rather live in a big city like London. I'd like to do some window shopping in Hollywood as well. Just wow. And you gave her clothes. Good on her. Honestly. God bless. Right, Professor Garlic. Who would have thought that grow could be so interesting? Oh. Oh god, don't put that near your face. No. The cabbage will eat you. You know schools usually have school like house houses as well kind of thing. And I find it the most strangest thing because in reality. Crazy. Because it really changes nothing. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium Leviosa requires. Meanwhile, Harry Potter learns this in his first year. Nice, graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. Wingardium Leviosa. Because reasons that should, should be, be obvious? Uh, no. What makes you think anything is obvious? In life. Wingardium Leviosa. I like how I did, I did copy that movement. Well 
Feel free to practice guarding Levia. You're a natural. I like how she goes from. You can practice over there. Oh, you're a natural. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Harry starts at year one, legacy person starts in year five. <laughs> it literally is that way though, it's just like meh. They, it, don't, no questions. <sighs> How's it going, Quasical? Hope you're going well. Man, I'm getting sleepy. I can't sleep. The groceries haven't arrived yet. That's the one thing. Even if I did stop while streaming, I wouldn't be able to actually sleep. Mm. Oh, man, oh, man. Okay. Everything's fine. Everything's good. Everything's cake. All right. How would you like to learn the knockback jinx flippendo? Once you've completed the necessary tasks, come and find me in the greenhouse. Complete the okay. tasks I've given you and then meet me in my classroom to learn Defindo, the severing charm. It's typically used to cut an object, but can be a powerful weapon when needed. That's what Defindo does? Why isn't it called... Severus? Lapis? Hello again, Mr. Oh, Lee. I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not. Uh, and from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. Do you see that curious statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now, if you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you Oh, these are the disguise things. Oh, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed. Which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Okay. Uh, ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Okay. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, meant you. that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart, or, or shapeshifter if you will, uh, which right. takes the form of whatever scares you most. This one took the form of a demiguise. A demiguise? <gasps> yes, terrifying creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are demigodesses. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on my name. 
Some jackanapes used a boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. I have sure. my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That okay. is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? Okay. A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has gained you a reputation this is an for odd fearlessness. Thing. You know, you'd Second, think as a caretaker, you'd just be like, sorry. Can you just clean this is, stuff up for me? Most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I, I simply can't bring myself to go near them. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them so uh, I can go about my evening duties. To take a piss? I'd be glad to help you, Mr. Moon. I see what you're oh, up to, man. I could count on you. Uh, <coughs> first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Hmm. You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However, will you get in? Hmm. Alahamora, that's how. But what about curfew? Curfew? Oh, tosh. I sent you a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. Right. And I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find right. one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. Oh, and thank you. Okay. All right. Buddy, I don't know how I feel about this. I'm not gonna lie. Like, this seems really sus. Hello, Mora. That went better than I thought it would, to be honest. You're in. Shush. Want me to sneak in, Remember, you fucking shadow? Use a disillusionment charm so no one claps eyes on you. This is a restricted area. Professor Fig, I'm in, in receipt of your most recent owl. Apologies for the delay in my response, receiving a good deal of correspondence. Uh, da, 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 da. Level two block. Why have a low Hamora when it only opens some stuff? Hogwarts staff. Second job of keeping the castle in order. Expect the copper was peeves. Be be clear. Be please be careful. Use LT and RT. Oh, right, yeah, okay. Yes, well, it's still early, 
Okay, I can't kill them with British Chichotels. I'm amazed that worked. Oh god. I hate this. I don't want to get in trouble. You can tell that I'm a goody two shoes. This must be the prefect's bathroom. Okay, up, up. Pavilion. She didn't send the hospital ring on account of my venomous tentacular. Not at the moment, no. Plenty of other perils and pitfalls to send them on. Suppose I should begin my rounds now. I suppose Professor Black knows best, but the students are terribly disappointed about Quidditch being cancelled. Huh. I had planned to bet a few galleons on Hufflepuff this season. Huh? Not Ravenclaw? Look at these guys just heckin' betting everything. Okay, that's stupid. Definitely should have seen me there, but okay. So many sound effects happening my brain's like how is any of these guys like how am i actually maintaining to be quiet Darling Abraham, I'm trying to know the local children have taken to gobstones with love. Matilda, is this the Weasleys' room? Abraham.
All right, um, eight plus five? That's 13, isn't it? Yeah, that's 13 already. Uh, three plus two equals five, so five plus nine. I question my math so much sometimes. I'm like, mm -mm, I don't know. Hard to call. Blank square frame. Cool. Okay. Alright, well. That went pretty well. Didn't get caught. Almost got caught. And of course I always get called by my favourite teacher. Ah. Hi! Mom. Got it. Yay! I missed a fig in there. Hello, Mora. Honestly, I like this, um... I like this unlocking contraption. I think it just works well. It's a little difficult. But aside from that, it's actually really cool. I guess this is Miss Garlic's room. I don't know what makes me think that. Serena. Mirabelle. Who's Mirabelle? My dear Dot has been asking after you. Oh, Dot? That name sounds familiar. Perhaps I can convince her to stop in for a butterbeer or two if you were to join us. Serena. Dot. Hello, Mr. Moon. That was weird. I have the moons you asked me to collect. Oh, goodness! Jump scare. You're as fearless as I'd hoped. An excellent start. Uh, if we can collect more, it may shed some light on who's behind all this. Of course, I first suspected Peeves. Right, Wings. Let's go. The Let's go. Have fun. I will, Diddy. Take care. Early retirement with his have a good day and or night. Buffoonery. But that does not explain the bogger in Oxmead, does it? No. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor. It's definitely intriguing. I'd like to help you solve this mystery. Uh, you, I my friend, are a gentle person and a, a scholar. And I have something to offer in exchange for your assistance. Now, remember, the moons are only retrievable at night. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. How many statues are there to find? I don't know precisely, but I've spotted dozens. Seems they're everywhere I look. You have your work cut out for you, if you were to ever unravel their meaning. Understood. I shall keep an eye out. I appreciate that. That's good to know, because I, I think I saw a few of them before and I was like, oh, what? I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it so we can solve this mystery. Right. Alright, next quest. Beast's class. Grow and harvest fluxweed. Acquire all three combat pens and use them simultaneously. Acquire an invisible ability potion. Acquire and use a Thunderbrew potion. I think I do have those two. And then I have to figure out how to find a... Uh, a troll. God, I don't even know where I'd look for a troll. I could always just fly around in the environment until I find out. Or at least continue with the storyline.
Ai, ai, ai. Uh. Beast class. Let's go. We're going to finally meet Poppy. Gonna be good. Fast. First things fast. Oh, I don't have anything more than that. I do not have flux weed. Damn it. Purchase from the magic neep. Uh... Well, you keep doing that then. Oh, I can't carry anymore. Oh, okay. Oh, good then. Alright, where are we after? Yeah. Go to here. <coughs> Interesting to think that in this game there is a curfew system. Maybe? I don't know if it's just supposed to be like only in quests. Because it definitely seems like it's only supposed to be a quest thing. So, I d yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. He's class. Alright, actually you go to talk. Uh... Ayo, this is a robbery. Hand over all your feet pics and no one gets hurt. And I've had a lovely evening, ladies and gents. Do not make me do something bad. <laughs> Here's the feet. Ugh. Just fucking slashes off my feet, hands them to you. The eternal feet pick. It's not concerning at all. Hello, Anakin. The knee will suffice. The knee will suffice. Okay, guys, gonna put our knees up. Ha, how are you doing? Reason of why Anakin cannot be trusted with money. Okay, go on. Okay, write down your story. I need to go to the toilet. I'm very sorry, but write your story. So I spent seventy dollars on Maccas for breakfast today. Okay, good start. Hashtag blame inf inflation. Anyway, back to you. How are you, Han? I'm going well. I'm enjoying the game. I'm a little tired. I've obviously has. Uh, obvi I've obviously been sick. Um, my voice is still a little shit. Um, but it's slowly getting there. Slowly. Um, yeah. <coughs> I just need to go to the toilet, so I'll be back in, like, 
soon, okay? Alright, um, yeah, so I accidentally spent 250 filling my gas tank to the brim, which I was in La La Land and not paying attention to the pump, and back to you. Anything crazy happened today? Um, uh, anything crazy? Uh, I played a video game. That's pretty crazy. If you call it crazy. Um, let's, 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 let's go back a second. Um, how do you... How do you spend $250 on petrol? Was it like, did you accidentally like overfill it? Because I'm pretty sure there's like an automatic, like most, at least in Australia, ours has like automatic systems where it like stops filling it in after a certain amount. Do you, does, does that not happen to your stuff? I like your shirt. Thank you. I probably shouldn't wear this sh shirt on stream. It makes me too self-conscious, but, um, yeah, how do you, uh, how does... No, that's only if you preset it. I did not preset it. Really? Interesting. I didn't even know that was possible. I probably should have. Because we always, I'm pretty sure every single one is automated and automatically presetted. To my knowledge. And knows it has been news to me. But yeah, crazy, crazy things. Welcome, everyone. So I only need a hundred dollars to get I through the week. Yeah, exactly. That's kind of what of I was the thinking. many beasts we study in this class. Though right. be advised, none Bird. of these creatures should be taken lightly. They, are they all will in murder their you. Own way, dangerous. I love them. Especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Got gas for next week as well. Yeah. Now it seems many of you are out Puppy. of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy, Poppy Sweeting. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. Oh! Miss Sweeting, pay attention, please. The tongue of a puffskin can be a slippery devil. Um, uh, yes, Professor. Sorry, can we Here. go back a moment? You can practice on Gerald. Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> um, you can use my brush. Just be gentle. Okay. Oh, oh my god. Okay. I like to think. Oh my god. Which is his experience. 
Oh, that's oh. lovely. I'm sure he feels much better. Oh. I think he might be hungry. Would you mind giving him some beast food? Absolutely. Oh. What do you suppose the pellets taste like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. I think we can safely say that Gerald likes you. That's good news. He seems very nice. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition and cleanliness. Good so cute. work, everyone. Good job, now, Gerald. Let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Otherwise, Whitting, you will die. Why don't you show our new student to the measles in the farthest pen? Measles? This like cheezles? The measles are over here. Cheezles? All I'm hearing is cheezles. <coughs> oh, couple of measles whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy canuts. something from Honey Jukes. <laughs> Excuse me, asshole? <sighs> Stupid thing. <sighs> Fucking bite him! What are you doing? Tusk, tusk, peculiar poppy. Worried about this guy sucks. little rodent. Tusk, Her tusk. Her name is Persephone. <laughs> Her name is Persephone. <laughs> That's really not funny. I fought a troll. I will decimate you. <sighs> Let's go. <laughs> the teacher deliberately standing in a place where they're where they're seen. Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Poachers in training. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald. Yeah. Yeah, brush them. Make sure they're loved. Yeah. Aww. Yes. No. All right, everybody gets food now. Have the floating food. <laughs> the measles really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one. Good egg. As do I. Oh, it thanks, Poppy. Our time has come to an end. Please close um, nom, the nom. pens and see yourselves out. Now, where is our new student? Ah, oh, there I... you are. That's me. I would like a moment, please. Can I pet the dodo birds? Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast's lesson? I think Hagrid's a cooler beast teacher. Yeah, I said it. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly. Which right. does not include torturing them for whiskers. Well done, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in Rookwood's poacher pack. Sadly, we're the ones who suffer. Stumbling over dead beasts. Terrible waste of resources. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The Ministry, perhaps. I'll do it. An optimistic idea. Murder! Well, why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? I swear it's all okay. Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other <coughs> years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Yes, ma'am. Meanwhile, ma I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. I will. I want to. Yeah, buddy. What's up? Did you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. 
You were an augury at noon in the desert. I certainly hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least, that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. Uh, should I be worried? Sounds intriguing. Me. Very well, lead the way. I'd hoped I would. Okay, Poppy, where are we off to? Wait, let me try and pet- take just anyone there. In fact, you're the first. Really? Well, thank you, I think. As I said, we think a lot- It's a chocobo! Pleasant surprise. It's a chocobo! Oh, they're so cute! Okay, all right. I don't think there was any other fluff balls. They're pink. So cute. Okay. All right. I'm paying attention, Poppy. I'm so sorry. I just, you know me. I just, oh, every game, every game. I really need like a really good sim game where it's not Pokemon, but it's like this, right? Where you actually like catch Quite a bunch of animals and you have to Do collect them all. Poppy. Where are you taking me? I don't know, man. Can I put on my other spells like usual? No? It really is much better if I just show you. Or... Don't worry. We're nearly there. It's just ahead. Let me use Accio again. Stand back. Alright. Yo, it's a hippog weave. That's really pretty. Please meet High Wing. Isn't she Hi, just High magnificent? Wing. Go on, introduce yourself to her, but be careful. You must always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. They had to do this. Your Majesty, a pleasure to meet you, Highwing. I knew it. I don't think I've ever seen a hippogriff take to someone this quickly. Yes, you can feed and brush pet the baby. I come and check on her every once in a while. Yeah. <laughs> Tell her what's going on in the castle. Happy, happy. You wouldn't know from looking at her, but she's a dreadful busybody. Om nom nom nom. Wow. Oh. So good. So precious. I love you, Eileen. <laughs> bye bye. I love you. Beautiful. Ten out of ten. So, what did you think of High Wing? I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me to her. We've I had one class together. I trust on. you. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? I hope I've so. I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and High Wing cross paths? It's a longer story. But I rescued her from poachers a few years back, got her to safety, and, well, she was fine until recently. You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area, so I worry they could get her again, and that I might not be there next time. Professor Howen mentioned the poachers as well. She seemed to imply that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. I don't we'll often have to do agree it. with Professor Howen, but on that, I fear she's right. The poacher's influence is growing. I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. I'm just not sure what. That does seem strange. 
Sounds as if they're planning something. Head off. Exactly. But how long do we have to roast Big to Horse him. Bird for? Find Would roast hippogriff even on. taste good? What they're doing. I'm sure it tastes delicious. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power, and the more um, I know, the on the other hand, I can keep hiding safe. You let's think about this. <coughs> it would have to be a slow oh, roast. I have to be on a spit as you turn going. it to have like an we'll even amount of soon, cooked on either side. Um, it would surely be like six hours. Like it's a it's a, it's a lot. Unforgivable castles. Truly. Transformation. I can use transformation. I could turn people into barrels. Pog. Alright. Go back to the quests and I wonder. Digital blast around you. Ooh, yo, get this. Okay, so this is all stuff I can't do. Wait, so according to this then, 10, 10, 20, um, so it's, uh, 40, uh, it's 48, so level 48 is the highest? So we're technically halfway through the leveling, almost, almost halfway through. That's interesting, okay. I, f I feel like it would have been more than that, but yeah, that's, that's such an interesting, it explains a lot. Uh, as well, actually. Okay. So. I guess I can't do that sweeting thing first. Alright. First things first, we're gonna go over here. It's so good. Hey you, Ravenclaw. Yep. Imelda Rays? Albie Week sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. Yeah. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. Seems someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me? Oh. Slytherin Quidditch captain. Jealous of you. Sure. Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers, and bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am okay. competition. You're not even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Enough of what? this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Ravenclaw. All Actually, right, let's do this. Why not? I'm so looking forward. 
Let's do this. Bumbling baboons. Bumbling baboons. This is rather fun. Oh god. I I went too fast. Oh god. I'm really struggling. Okay. God, my my depth perception is dying, as it usually does with these flying sort of things. Flashback to DK64. I did, I did really well. That was actually really good, considering how unnerving the start was. <coughs> oh. And this, kids, is why we don't drink fire whiskey before flying. <laughs> yes, exactly. Uh, that's not... You, you must have cheated, you... Uh, fine. You won. <sighs> Don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my yes, will means something. Eh, you're not terrible, but you're still going to... Challenge accepted, then. Perhaps you have what it takes after all. We shall see. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium, where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. Okay. I have to do it again? I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear how I fed. One more guard. One more guard. Made it. Fuck. <laughs> now that's more. Could have done better. No. <laughs> Okay, yeah, no, nah, that's it. God, it's almost like, stop, stop, stop. I'm not even pressing the buttons anymore. Can I restart? Did it. What the fuck? I think it's like, because I keep trying to angle fucking shit. I keep wanting to like angle so that I face straight on and it just doesn't.
are all the fun. Not too bad considering I fucked up the start. Made it. I mean, obviously this is with a 12 second penalty. Woo. Definitely a fluke. Definitely a fluke the first time. <laughs> Again. I'm just going to be more careful. Ah, oh, success. Shit, 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 fuck. It keeps just going way too fast. I don't even know. Oh god. Holy shit. I don't know how I'm gonna get 132, but... Two is basically like a perfect score. <coughs> that's pretty bad. Yeah, I wouldn't be adding you to my Quidditch team. You know what? That's fair. That's a fair call. Oh shit. I don't know if I have to do this. Is this like a thing for a quest or not? Ah, I got second. That's good enough for me. <laughs> okay. Uh. Uh, da -da 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 -da. All right, I want to go to here. Yeah, I need to get Fluxwood and... Was there something else? Oh, and I need to go talk to Serona. All good. God, I'm tired. I really, really want to have a quick nap, but again, I still don't know when my groceries. It says anywhere between one and seven, and the the uh, email usually tells you approximate time. I couldn't see it this time around. I couldn't see an approximate time, so I'm like, don't know when it's coming. <laughs> I get the feeling it's not going to be till six, but I still have to be awake just in case. <sighs> oh, it's you! What a pleasant surprise! Hello, Teasdale. 
Now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. I'll need it eventually now, anyway. I might as well just buy it. Else I can help you with. That's why I always feel like with these, uh, with trying to buy these items, there's always that part of me that's like, no, I shouldn't buy it yet. And there's the other part of me that's like, if I buy it now, though, I don't have to worry about it later. And then I can buy all my shit. Ominous. I really would love to play this on, like, an Xbox, though. <laughs> With, like, the best graphics on and stuff. That'd be really cool. The well just man, when you loaded in, gave you side-eye. Crucio! Specifically his sack. Oh my god. Can you imagine? It'd be so painful. I'll be with you in just a minute. Oh, good lady. Well, just checking you're not well, selling anything. Show you some of what's available. Doors always open. You be sure to stop by soon. Actually, I do need this. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I, I don't call it a wise why. purchase. I call it a purchase that I need Let to make. Lumos. Side near a smokestack. Mm, yes, fully powered X uh, Xbox. Sometimes I have that option. Dogs mm. You should, whenever you get, whenever it comes out in the game, and you pr maybe <gasps> get it. Show me how pretty it is. Maybe, just maybe. Ugh. Is it up here? Supposed to be behind the place. Ah, whatever. Worry about that a different day. I need to go sell my shit. There we go. I love how this is the same jumping animation as I don't. No, obviously it's not the same same, but it reminds me of the jumping in Assassin's Creed. A little bit more fluid though. I mean, jumping's pretty similar in all games, but. Just about the feel. The ministry's good work. Get it. Come on in and have a look around. Uh, no touching if you have sticky fingers. Selling everything. This is the only way I get money, I guys. You have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Um, sure. I don't know if I'd call it a. You know, I don't really know what I would call it, but probably not. <gasps> I can. Oh, I can break into people's houses now. Right. Okay, we gotta find someone's house to break into. Entered. What have I found here? I just walked to a building and now I'm like, huh? Oh, yes. Alohomora. Beautiful. 
gonna get this at all. Too much fuckery going on. That's that's a fair call. What do we have here? The demi guys. Wait, the demi guys? Okay. We found a demi guys. Can't grab it because it's not night time. Can I make it pass from night time to daytime? Private room. This is actually interesting, and this will probably be relevant to something later on. Alright, well, I'll grab it a different day. Just put it into my mental brain box. There is a demi guys here. I'll probably struggle later to find a door, but that's fine. It's all part of the experience. You'll understand how it is. Uh, my stomach. I had milk, I think, for the first time in a while. And my stomach's not happy with me. <sighs> because I was sick, you know? You're not supposed to have milk when you're sick because it's bad for your throat. Were you saying something? So oh, friends hello. that are calling out, I call it. Talking to myself. I'm Clementine. Will it see? Charmed. I was. So friends that are call out, calling out by ro rolling. The edge of the are cool forest. with it because of things Whenever discussed. Others are friends buying this are not allies. And not friends. Hogwarts, yeah. Truly were forbidden from entering no, I do not blame you. Told horrible stories about it. Luckily, I haven't had too much of that at all. I'm still paranoid by it. It's silly. But, but I'm insatiably curious besides as from to that, where the butterflies fine. go in the forest. You couldn't possibly find out, could you? You want me to follow the butterflies? I do, follow yes, the butterflies. If you wouldn't mind. I got a mossy bite on my leg. Very well. If I have time, I shall see Die. where they lead. Oh, how kind! Students these days have so much more courage than I ever did. You can usually find me right around here. I hope to see you soon. Are you a drunkard? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Don't forget, the butterfly- Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Rookwood and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona, please. Then I was oh. happy to help. Oh, those two are nothing but trouble. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lodgog. <sighs> He's a friend. It seemed as though you were on good terms with him. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now? We are. Would they be friends with a human, though? Hear me out. Real question. But they talk about fear of wizard kind, okay? But what about fear of human kind? Is, more than I can say is it the same thing? Classmates. I feel like there'd be... there has to be a medium here. Hell, I'd be more than happy to turn it into a charity series, all proceeds, etc. Too, but... but too much social effort to be bothered dealing with it. No, my sister suggested the same thing. And I'd be fine with it if it wasn't for the fact that my brain's like... I don't even make enough to earn rent. <laughs> like... I've only just started earning a bit more from my job. And had a bit more regular shifts, so it's working slowly. He's a trusted metal trader. You should mention that we spoke. Yeah. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards. Oh, they could have done Serena's voice a bit better. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him Yeah, in, there was stuff I saw online that was like... Lodgok. This person's trans. And it's Thank like... You, if you find uh, Lodgok, please give him my best. I don't know what you've done to make such powerful enemies, but please, watch your back. I'm not entirely sure what the point of it is. I don't know if that's the intention. I don't know if that's what anything means. I'm not worrying about stuff like that. I'm enjoying the game and the atmosphere. Yeah. Breaking in the people's houses. What? Where? I don't see a demi guys. What are you seeing that I don't? Level 2 lock. 
right? I'm seeing things or hearing things. Good to see you outside the castle. <gasps> Amit, you're doing great, Amit. Proud of you. Still looking forward to that astronomy class. What else did you get into? Welcome Ravenclaw. Any empty seat is yours. Hello, Lord Gok. Serona said I might find you here. Yes, she did, did she? How you doing, Chloe? Did she send you with news? No, actually, I wanted to speak with you. It's about Ranrock. Now I remember. The three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You're the student he's after. I am. Yeah, And I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to. So I can stay a step ahead. Dying in the heat. Yeah, it's been pretty bad. It's pretty cold today here, but... Some people lost their shit over the name. Now I get why they say Sir Rona is bad for the name of a trans witch, but they also bitched about the last name. Oh, that's what they meant. I was so confused because like they'd say that, and my brain's like, "What's wrong with it?" Serona trusts me, and she said she thought our interests may be aligned. Hmm. Well, if Serona. It's like thirty-eight. You, Holy shit! Very well. I may know something that could that. help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Ranrock and I had what about a, Dobby? a falling out. What about the house elves? Back. They're the supposed to be basically well omnipotent. The chasm between us. Very well. I'll retrieve the relic if you promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you... Why would I care about the relic? Share what I learn. Gather whatever supplies you may need, and meet me near the witch's tomb. I need thunder broom. Alright, where are we going? Uh, where am I? Wait, how far away? What? Huh? Yeah, but the okay. Alright, okay, okay, okay. One thing at a time. That thing's first. I need to go back up this way, I think. Oh, wait, it's night time now. Oh, God. So many buttons. Okay, there's another one of those moth ones. I feel like I'm gonna have to go back and do all the moth paintings so much. But every time my brain's like, eh, whatever. Should be right. My first employment was at Honey Dukes. <laughs> Stock girl I was. Okay. So, we have the three broomsticks right over here. I think it's night time enough. Rebellion. Like, yeah, it's an Irish name. Same with Ryan as the surname. Ryan should be fine, but yeah. Could have rethought the first name. That's true. And with something like that, like, you could, I mean, like, it's impossible to tell if it was malicious or not. A person could have just piped up and was like, oh, I really like this name. And they were like, yeah, yeah, like, that's, that's a good name. And just didn't even think about it, you know? Mind now, demiguys. Yee yee. Can I not grab it? It's night time, isn't it? Pick it up. Yeah. 
Ridiculous. Bloody hell. Alright, well, whatever. I'm gonna teleport because I'm struggling. Even just randomize gen from an Irish name database, even. Yeah. Possibly. Uh... That's why most of the time my brain's like, eh. I don't know. I don't know what people are thinking. I'm happy to just hang out. And, uh, and it's one of those things where a lot of people, like 30 and under, you know, grew up with like Harry Potter. Uh, especially, especially like my generation. Um, you know, like grew up parents reading us the books, going to the movies and seeing it together, you know, like it's it's hard to dissuade just the entire franchise to just what like the author says. Because it's so much more than that. You know, it's memories, it's experiences that you've been through. My sister had a tenth birthday party as Harry Potter. It was pretty cool. We had like a sign on the parents' door that was like the forbidden forest, so you don't go in there. Um and we had like a lamington like castle cake. It was it wasn't the best best lamington castle cake, but it was still cool. Um Looks sweet, here I come. And we all had like and my sister got this like cloak made which she still has to this day. I think uh our I think our cousin made it. I'm pretty sure. Our cousin Tim made it. Welcome. Do let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. Yeah. Oh, Goodbye, wow, money. Decision. Thank you. Oh god, that's so expensive. Can I make one? I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Yep. I'm going back to the room of requirement. Fine, destroy it. Can I make one? No, I need shrivel fig. Shit. Wait, no, I didn't buy that seed, did I? Incorrect pot side. Fuck. ready to learn Arresto Momentum, the slowing charm. What? It allows you to freeze objects or people in midair. Simply complete a few tasks and then come and see me. Wow, it really is that easy. Huh. I keep spending money on the wrong things, and I'm so disappointed. Uh... Well, I can't still do... Free combat plants and use them simultaneously. I can't still do that one. Um, practice flying near the spies and the keen bridge tower. Okay. Invisibility potion and use a thunder brew potion against enemies, which again I can't do. And to bolso. I 
and find a troll. be so bad except Rowling's views her income as a mark of justification yeah but it's also like she's got millions and millions of dollars we're <coughs> we're not gonna change anything sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade as just a beloved author. Yeah, yeah. I definitely agree. Here? Okay. Just could have left it at that and just nothing else. No. I don't even know. I'm ready. I'm struggling to see anything on my screen. Good. There's no time to lose. Uh, give me a second, bro. Lumos. What okay. precisely is the relic I'm to retrieve? A valuable heirloom known as the Helmet of Urtgot. The witch considered herself a collector and purchased the helmet as a trinket. She cared not what pain she caused the goblins. Goblins believe that the rightful owner of any object is its maker, not its purchaser. Wizard That's kind sees things differently. It's a wonder goblins and wizards have ever been able to work together. The differences between our kinds are myriad. They seem to be. It may surprise you to know that I do not believe those differences always to be insurmountable. It is the reason I find myself traveling with you to this tomb today. We move a little bit faster. Yeah, that's what I like to see. Enemies that run when you run. It's my favorite. Yeah. Enemies, Anne? What enemies? Ah, and there it is, the witch's tomb. Oh, oh I've been here. Okay. Looking place, isn't Said it? enemies. When? Wait. What? Did I mean friends? I don't remember what I was just talking about. Oh. I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention. I wish you luck retrieving yeah, enemies, the as a one friends, you should have acquaintance, advantage. acquaintance, now acquaintances. Off, I love them all. Do you have any questions? Cake. Don't suppose you have any idea what could be waiting for me inside the tomb. Considering a dark witch was involved. I suppose there's a chance you may encounter the Dark Protectors, known as Inferi. The foul creatures thrive on darkness and the cold. Vanquish them with light, force, and most effectively, fire. What about this helmet makes it so special? The Helmet of Urtgot is an ancient and storied relic, forged Enemies during to a love time us. of we unity love that. the Goblin and fairy. <laughs> It inspired greatness. We love enemies is, to lovers. It's it was the hottest. No ours. Then it became something else. A symbol of what has been lost. Of all that wizard kind has taken from us. Reclaiming it would mean a great deal to goblin kind. And to Ranrock. He would be grateful to me should I return it. Okay. Ugh. It all seems clear to me now that we're here. I do hope our alliance proves fruitful. Again, I wish you luck. I will remain here, eagerly awaiting your return. Please, be careful. 
I'll try my best. Just waiting to meet Han's future BF, a real enemies to love a story. Remember when he tried to mug me? Honestly, that sounds like something I would do. I've always decided that if anyone actually tried to rob me, I'd sit there and be like, no, stop, I'll fucking take you out for dinner, okay? Don't steal from me. Just, you know, like, come along and, like, I'll fucking invite you to have some food. It'll be fine. <laughs> In classic me fashion. Uh... No. It's sealed. Okay. Moss. Lumos. The only you'll st you're stealing today is my heart. The only thing you're stealing today is my heart. <laughs> I love that. Absolutely. That's funny. I was talking to a friend last night and she was like, she was like trying to get like a read on me or something. Where it's like, I reckon you'll find the guy at church. And I'm sitting there like, I don't go to church anymore. How am I going to find him at church? This can't be the witch's tomb. Likely I need to go further. Lumos. Okay, that worked. Lumos. Anything else? Ooh. Ah! Shh, I'm sorry, Lumos. butterfly, come back. Man, well, lucky Philip isn't here for this. He would have freaked out. Is there a window? Nope, just shading. Okay. I have a feeling I'm not alone here. What makes you think that? I'm Bobby. Bobby Bobbinsystein. Wrong one. Lumos. You have uncollected rewards. I return. Welcome back, Chloe. What's up? How's it doing? How's the cake? I should really make some cake. None of this. Man, I really like cake business. I mean, actually, damn. Here's a cake. And it's fucking good. Uh. Lumos. Hmm. If I could power it somehow, it looks Through like butterfly it magic, anything is possible. Try two on both sides. What about the other one? Lumos. This has a moth imprinted on it. The same as the door. 
Wait, did it duplicate? Now I'm confused. What? Huh? fire. Okay. Uh. Alright. Thank you. Rapana was showing me the room of requirement. Hey, Very cool. So you've been enjoying watching parts of the game so far? Only just got access. Well, I say only just got access. Today. When I say today, I mean like four hours ago, so I've done a lot since. Looks precarious. Um It's sealed shut from the other side. But yeah, it takes a little bit into the game. A lot longer into the game than I thought it would, in order to get access to the room of requirement. Cause it took me a good maybe like twelve hours of gameplay. <laughs> I mean, I guess it depends if you're doing storyline or not. Uh... Oh shit. Do I need this? Down I go. No other way. It's really no other way. No other safer way. Yeah. Goodbye, Box Chan. Wish me luck. I use his computer, so I've not learned, not long learned the fire spell, but I've been exploring a lot. Hell yeah. That's the good times. Can't even just walk three times in front of the tapestry and shake my head. It's gotta be more complicated. Where's this leading me? Oh! Legendary. Huh. Alright, ready on mark. Here they come. Gentlemen, fire is really loud. Fucking lawn. All right, here we go. 
<laughs> anyway. Oh, man. All right. That that was fun. That was okay. Nice. Butterflies. Ah. This game is so good. I do like the fact that, again, it does very nice. subtle, like, puzzles, but puzzles that I don't think are boring. I think a lot with, like, certain video games, can't they be an exact example? Oh, shit. Oh, well. Let me up! Let me up! even more complex uh yeah how like um sometimes they do puzzles but the puzzles kind of get boring after a while and it doesn't always do a great job of having like fresh new puzzles on the other hand, doing puzzles that are too similar can also, uh, sorry, uh, like, too different every time can also be really weird, but at least with this particular instance, I think they have a really nice balance between the two. Um, because, you know, like, there's some puzzles where it's like, oh, I recognize this one, <laughs> just do the right thing. Um, but then there's other ones where it's like, oh, I have to use my noggin. Oh, I think I know. Is this close? No, I have no idea. Um, is there a way to... Can I put it on something? Lumos. Okay. Let me go. To raise that platform, that must be it. Really, that's not the part I need help with. Can I freeze the contraption? The answer is no. Lumos.
I need to bring moths to the door. Oh! Lumos. <laughs> Can bring her splat. <laughs> yeah. Really hates these moths. I don't mean to. The witch's final resting place. Lodgok said the helmet was in her sarcophagus. The dead Ashwinder. Your compatriots must have made off with the helmet. Lord, better show this to Lodgok. There must be some sort of mechanism for this doorway. Oh, okay. It's just that easy. Yeah, we did it. Big brain. Just had to turn around. Genius. What? Oh my god, it's five o'clock. Where'd the last hour go? The last hour just vanished. Okay. All right then. Well, uh, <laughs> I need to finish up real quick. Real soon. Uh, I just want to keep playing. I mean, I will oh soon. The sarcophagus has been raided. Once I've had dinner, I though. found no helmet. Only a dead ash. Me out here debating Damn. a nap. Dude, same. First. We need to get it before Rookwood uses it to further ingratiate I want to have enough, but the groceries are supposed to be arriving. But they didn't here, specify when. You must go so alone. I've just been kind of like... Fighting days are behind me. I'm shrugging all day. I'll head there now. Good. There's no time to lose. Get to that helmet before Rookwood does, or we will lose our chance at any leverage, no matter how small, with Ranrock. Good point. To think those wretched thieves have their hands on such a relic. Maybe. We'll find out. What the fuck was that? A troll? Well, there's that troll. There they are. The Ashwinders. They're having a great day. You guys are doing a great job, by the way. Really love the initiative. Okay, they turned around. They've got a forest troll. Bro, trying so hard, you're doing great, Chunk Chum. Ah, uh, he's broken. Now, this has become personal. Expulsion! Doing a great job, guys. Look up. Now, 
Give me one second. Did I do it? Expulso! Ow. magic I was using. You're a nice purple. Wrong one. Whoops. Don't you want to know? God, it's so funny looking back at that being like that, being like, wow, great performance, man. Really convincing. <laughs> As I would argue, not convincing. That's all you want to know. As he just fucking passes out. Any other items to pick up? Ah. Shit. Everyone in Upper Hopefield shudders when they see me back, and rightfully so. I hope Rookwood knows what he's doing. We'll be back later. Looks rather dark in there. Never stopped me before. I retrieved the helmet from the Ashwinders. Well done! This is sure to impress Ranrock. The helmet shines even more brightly than I imagined. The etchings, the contour of the profile, remarkable. It looks stunning, Lodgok. I see why you wanted it back. You did the thieves a service by recovering it. I know many a goblin who would have killed for it. Ah, huh, then I'm glad to be rid of it myself. Thank you. This should earn Ranrock's trust. I will take it to him immediately. It may distract him from his search. His search? It, uh, it is merely an inkling. You have impressed me greatly, friend. I am glad that I trusted you. We shall speak soon. Best to keep our arrangement Thanks, quiet Lodka. for now. Many will not believe that our aims might possibly be aligned. All right, bud. 
See you around. On another adventure, are we? Yay! Have a new quest. Uwu. Alright, cool. That went pretty smoothly. Hello, friend. I wonder if you might stop by the three broomsticks when you can. I would More. like your help with something. More. As I mentioned, my sister Anne misses Hogwarts, and she hasn't been herself lately. I'd like to take you up on your promise to visit her with me. I'm heading to Feldcroft soon, so I'll look forward to seeing you there. It's just south of Hogwarts. By the way, hope you're faring well with the blasting curse. It's still one of my favorites. I've been enjoying it too, now dude. Honestly, it's really good. Class, I've asked Deke to assist <gasps> you in using the room to further yes! in that regard. Please meet him there when you can. I need to finish stream. I've not heard from my uncle Roland in quite some time. I've been oh. beside myself with worry. Could you meet me in the courtyard? Okay, bud. Professor Onai's assignment. There's more? Oh wait, no, that's someone else's, right. Gotta keep an eye out, an eye out for any nooks and crannies I can access in the castle. Sweet. All right, this is the last thing, I promise. Probably. Promise. I promise. I'll do it this time. This shouldn't take longer than a minute-ish. That's a lie. Shouldn't take too long. Hello, Hogwater. This is your Fire Emblem Engager viewer. Sure. Hi, Kaizen. How's it going? <coughs> we will continue Fire Emblem, probably. Ah. Deke is so happy to see you. And Deke noticed this bag in the room the other day. You must need it to help with your schoolwork. Deke has seen one of these before. Deke calls it a knapsack. A bag of holding? Perfect for gathering and transporting beasts. Yes. Let's go around. New place, Pleasant new life. Breeze. Good day. I have been thinking about something Professor Howen said in Beasts class that I should study as many beasts as I can on my own time. She also mentioned that poachers have been active in the area. So perhaps the beasts will be safer with us than out there on their own. Precisely what Deke was thinking. You see, the room knew exactly what you needed. And luckily, Deke can show you how to best use the knapsack and where. Yes. Come on, then. Let's go. I'm so excited. Our first stop will be beyond the castle grounds. We can what? leave now, or you can come and find Deke when you're ready to go. I'm ready. Let's go. Come on. I'm ready to learn how to. Got use my Anna engage OP. Gave her the new DLC hero Soren. I got really confused. Um, I don't think I've met the character Anna yet, but nice. In Engage OP. 
a uh, dude. I'm looking forward to get to seeing Soren in the game. That's gonna be good. She's like a glass cannon that shoots from across the map. Oh, shit! Yeah, hell yeah. <coughs> That'd be good. I need to get back. I need. I do need to get back to the game. Oh, you meet her early. I'm trying to figure out which one's Anna. What color hair? Yeah, Soren was good in the advanced game. A nasty poacher. Dick hated working for him. He did horrible things to beautiful beasts. Oh. It was during those days that Deke first saw a knapsack. Uh, it'll be nice to see one used for good. Slap up with the babies. That... Shut up. Um. <clears throat> um. Nothing. The pet, like, pet them we and then arrived. put them into the. Deke enjoys coming here to watch the beasts. She's the merchant girl in every game. Japan loves her. It'll uh... be nice to keep them safe. All you will need to do is get close, direct the open knapsack toward the puff skein, and in it'll go. All right. Okay. How do I do this? Difficult, I mean you no harm. Everything's all right now. This is kidnapping. But, you know, I'm sure it's fine. Professor Howard, it's like Ghostbusters. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, that's probably a pretty good, pretty, pretty apt description. Surprise adoption. <laughs> I managed to rescue a puff skein. You can rescue as many as the knapsack will hold. Poachers capture puff skeins and, well, Deke isn't sure what they do with them. Deke is certain they will be safer with you. Now, not all beasts will be as simple to rescue as a puff skein. Deke suggests you next find a beast that can fly. A jobbernol, perhaps. All right. Where would I find one? Deke knows of some to the west, nesting in a large tree overlooking Hogwarts. But we must be careful. Deke has seen poachers in the area recently. Deke will meet you there whenever you're ready. Okay, it looks like this might go on for quite a bit longer, so I will have to finish that. We'll play more of this literally in less than three hours, so I'll be back. Don't you worry having too much fun with this game. <coughs> I wonder if I just leave it up while I go do stuff. I probably could actually. Maybe it wasn't Game Boy. Um, maybe the GameCube one? He was the tactician for your army. Wait, Blazing Blade or Sacred Stones? I don't remember Soren. Soren always sounds- I, I recognize the name Soren, but that's because I looked up art of Fire Emblem more than anything else. Yep, but yeah, he's a mage. He's cool. I remember him being really cool. <laughs> okay. Um, but yeah, I gotta- I gotta disappear. Gotta have dinner, make dinner, do summon dinner, dinner whatever ends up happening. Art. It's art. <coughs> oh, you meant, oh, uh, okay. No. No. I was like 13 at the time. What is wrong with you? 
No, I heard about Fire Emblem and I used to look up all of the artworks because they had these amazing outfits and I loved it and I remember like trying to like design characters based off it. It's great. God damn it, Daft. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you'll have an excellent day today and tomorrow. I'll be back in a few hours and we'll keep playing more. My neighborhood's kid is 10 and we heard him looking up art. Yes. But, um, I am not that kid. Or any other kid, to be honest. Ugh. Alright. God, I really want to have a nap. Oh my god. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. Take care. Uh, yeah, see you around. Bye. Nap time. Go, Chloe. Do it. Get that nap. <laughs>